For every person out there who's been talking about how useful ChatGBT is for creating content online, there are probably three more cynics who are complaining that ChatGPT can't really be useful at all because it's not reliable, it's not trustworthy, and if it gives you facts or if it tells you stories or if it shares statistics or anything like that in the content that it creates, you have no idea if those things are true or not. Or if it tells you how to do something, you have no idea if that is accurate and if it's good advice. Well, I just figured out this little hack that largely overcomes this issue and I think makes ChatGPT even more powerful and useful for creating content. So I just wanted to make this quick video to share it with you. So basically all you need to do is ask ChatGPT to fact check itself. Now you probably don't wanna use those words cause I'm not sure if the AI will really understand what you mean. For example, the other day I was making a video about how to write an about page and I wanted a great statistic for the intro of my video talking about how important about pages are on your website and how they're one of the most popular pages on most sites. And I knew I'd heard a statistic like that somewhere, but I wasn't really sure. So I decided to ask ChatGPT if it could tell me any statistics or facts about the popularity or the importance of about pages. But I included this very important thing. I asked ChatGPT to cite its sources. And sure enough, ChatGPT immediately dished me up three relevant pieces of information along with sources. So I knew that ChatGPT wasn't making this stuff up, that these were real numbers based on real studies, and I was able to decide whether or not the sources were good enough. Because just because something came from a verifiable source or was based on some sort of study does not necessarily mean that it is true, and I want to be able to vet for myself whether or not it was a good source or a reliable study. And by ChatGPT including those sources, with links, I was able to do that. But I'd love to know what you think. Does this make ChatGPT more powerful, more useful? Does it make you more inclined to use it when you are creating content? I know I'm definitely gonna be using this trick every single time I rely on ChatGPT from now on because I wanna make sure that the content I'm creating is factually accurate. Okay, well, that's all for today. Just wanted to share that quick tip with you. If you happen to be new here and you haven't subscribed yet and you're interested in online business and marketing, then you might consider subscribing. And if you're looking for something new to watch right now, then check out this video right here, all about the very most profitable business that I figured out you can start with ChatGPT.